So, here we are, the last filler episode of Season 3. Unlike some of the previous ones, this one really is a lot filler. Like, nothing really happens here that matters. I am happy about this episode. Don't mistake me, I enjoy it well enough. Mostly because it's an AP5 episode and Chopper episode, and I tend to like those two working together. Except it's not really an AP5 and Chopper episode, it's an AP5 episode. Wedge is barely there and Chopper is mind-controlled. And I feel like that's one of the weak, weaker points of the episode, that AP5 has to singularly carry the episode. Now, I do like AP5 statements. You know, they always ignore droids. If I was in charge, you know, he would never get away with any of this, blah, blah, blah. I mean, it's right. And of course, you know, they're antagonistic and they yell and argue and it's very boring and stupid. Poor Wedge. Then AP5 picks up pretty much immediately on Chopper being different. Just like that. And then nobody listens to AP5 about Chopper being different. Now, that irritated me. And then Hera notices something different, comes in and is like, hey, something's different. And then they start working together. At least Hera personally apologizes to AP5 for all of this and been like, look, I apologize. And then, you know, they, they have to defeat a, you know, Chopper, a.k.a. the Imperial Controller. And that brings me to the Imperial Controller. It's an Imperial dude hooked up to those data things with a whole bunch of servitors hooked up to those data things. Based on the way it's presented, it looks like the actual controller guy himself still has his full cognitive abilities, and the others are basically slaved to the system. That makes sense, based on the way these things are usually portrayed. And it's also, it's a fascinating idea, really, that they would actually try to, you know, cook people literally up into a system. So functionally, only one person is actually running that ship, and it's Intel a Agency. That, that, that makes sense. And it's a cool idea. It's absolutely horrifying and kind of messed up, but it's a cool idea, and it's cool to see that concept. Uh, so then they decide to send the, the message back, and they just blow up his ship. Yeah, I'm okay with that happening. And then AP5 starts singing. No joke, I'm sitting right here, you know, watching the episode on my computer because I'm watching through Amazon. And I'm literally just... Uh, he's... Uh, what are the bird things? Where do they come from? He's actually... He, what? I just, okay, whatever. It's a filler episode. Next time we've got something substantially more significant happening, and I'm very curious where we're going to go with that one. I'll see you next time, guys.